Hi guys, I'm going to show you how I do my FG knots. So I take my 80 pound braid, I then make a loop about I don't know, 300, 300 mil long, pinch it at the end, and I'll wrap that around my little finger. And then it comes to a point where I want to use my index finger and my thumb to make a triangle. So that triangle is too big, I'm stretching too much. So one more loop. That's a perfect comfortable triangle. I then grab my leader, if I can pick it up. So the tag under my leader, I'm going to stick that through the triangle. And then I'm going to pinch it with my thumb. And then I'm just going to go over, under, over, under. I'm making sure I keep tension and make sure these loops are very, very tight. Over, under, over, under, over, under, over. Under, over, under, over, under, over, under, over, under, and I do it until pretty much I can't do any more. Under, over, under, over, under. That'll do us. So that's how it should look like. If you can see that, nice and neat. And then you're gonna pinch that, you don't wanna let that one go. Unravel it from your little finger. So this is my main line, that's going to my reel. This one is my tag end. I'm just gonna do a couple of half hitches. First one's always a little bit tricky. Use your mouth. he doesn't come undone. You want to make sure that half hitch is sitting at the front and not worked his way back a couple of... The... I'm pulling him really tight. Same again, we'll do this two more times, so three half hitches in total. Number one. Pull him nice and tight. Same again. This is going over your main line and your mono. So make sure you do that. Over, under, see him slide down the main line and the mono. Put them tight. And then I like to finish with a recesso, 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 finish. So just grab your tie end, make a loop, pinch it with your finger. Bring it through. One, two, three, four, five, six. So that's how it should look. You then make sure they're all nice and neat as well, because it makes this bit a lot easier. You then want to unwrap it from the knot end now. So you want to be going over your tag end and your mono and your main line. So, so and what we're doing is unwrapping this series of wraps you've just put on. So, three, four, five. Again, make sure they're all nice and neat. And then this is my last one. Look. We've got no more wraps to go. I like to pinch that one a little bit and then pull the tag end through. Give them a bit of a pull. Make sure we do it really tight. And there you have it. Your FG knot. Cut off 
few tag ends. Cut off this tag end, but leave, I don't know, a couple, three, three or four mil. So it's like that. And grab a lighter, and then obviously you pull everything away. What you want to do is make a little mushroom at the end of this. Back in the window. And there you have it. Your FG knot with a result re finish. Can't say that today. But yeah. As tight as you want. Really neat knot. Hasn't let me down yet. <sighs> like every bloke says, that ain't going nowhere. There we have it. The FG knot.